What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, D-Millen. Look, we're back with another video. And as I can jump in the title, man, we got the Cavs versus the Magic Game 7. And look, y'all, I told y'all, we're going to react to Game 7. I know I think the last game we watched, I believe, was Game 4. And I think Orlando won that game right there. So, look, 3-3, tied up. Back in Cleveland, Van Caro, Donovan Mitchell. We got, look, two of the best players in the East, man, to be honest, bro. Young player. And Van Caro and um vet proven player OG Donovan Mitchell, Darius Garland. We got the whole Orlando squad, young Orlando squad. And look, y'all, no Jared Allen tonight for Cleveland. So I mean, I'm I'm rocking with the young guys, man. I'm rocking with Orlando. I really want Orlando to win, y'all, cause uh I want to go to a Magic game, bro. So <laughs> I want to go. I want to see uh um the second round Magic. Well, Magic uh Celtics if they end up winning. So hey. Room for Magic today. Hopefully they win so I can go ahead and see a, a playoff game, another playoff game. And um, we're going to start off right there. But I'm going to ask y'all first off, make sure y'all like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn on post notifications if y'all haven't already. And look, man, let's get right into it, man. Y'all leave down below y'all comments and thoughts on who's going to come out the East, who's going to win this game. Well, y'all going to see when the game is ended. But, but who's going to win the next series between either the Magic, uh, Magic Cavs versus Celtics? We got to go win that. We got them gonna come out the East. My team, hey man, New York. Got to rock with New York. Everything, man. Look, my Nets. <laughs> my Nets kind of came up short, so we rock it with my dog Jalen Brunson <laughs> in the Garden. So, hey man, New York gonna come out the East. But let's see. Let's see what we got tonight. Let's see who we gonna win this one. You see their size and length at the rim. Garland not able to finish. Evan Mobley not able to finish. If you drive against them, they have size in the paint. Van Caro knocks down the shot. Magic looking for their first playoff series win in 14 years. As Donovan Mitchell yeah, 14 inside, years? Which he did time Last time they won was so 2010? 2010, when was that? 2010, who they have on their team in 2010? LA. 2010, 2010 Orlando. To create separation and finish. Double team finds Harris. Harris goes inside. Oh, Good Orlando. Who's on that team? Only 10 Magic? Good deal. Man, that's going to make me mad, bro. 2010 Magic. Who's on that team, y'all? I think the evolution for Evan Mobley is to become a volume three-point shooter. If they're going to pair him with... Was that Dwight Howard? Gets his own miss, kicks it out, Good shot. Was that Dwight Howard and them boys on that team in 2010? That sounds about right. I, that sounds about right to me. Dwight Howard on the, on the Magic. That sounds about right. Defensive player of the year, Dwight Howard. That sounds about right. I got to look that up. Today who can step up, make four or five threes, and provide that lift and spark. And right now, Ben Caro's just doing it himself. <laughs> I love Ben Caro hooping right now. Somebody said he like a uh, mellow LeBron hybrid. Uh, um, Mitchell kicks I don't it back know, down. bro. Fakes. Drives. I don't know. Melo LeBron hybrid is kind of tough. Looming inside Isaac. It's eight. I won. To my guy right there, man. Levert, man. I miss him in Brooklyn, dog. To my dog right there, man. Six points we're under a minute to go. Fultz goes inside. Nice adjustment. Markel Fultz off the bench with a couple of buckets. Mitchell, the Euro step. Off the glass. Rolls around and no good. Thompson's tip misses. Gets another rebound. The extra effort. Now Mitchell drives inside oh. and banks it in. <laughs> that boy down to the Mitchell right boy. For Orlando. Anthony up top. Mo Wagner. That's a three. They're five of ten from three point range. He's got ten points, four rebounds, two assists. Drives inside. Whoa. The the little high pickup one two. Oh, we gotta run that back that was tough man carol came down push cross hey hey good that was tough right there the push cross the right one that was tough you know he has a lot of bad probably potential passing and then carol comes the other way garland tried to get it cole anthony was right there the rest of the way and wagner said we had a chance to make the play in game last year but just gave away too many games so the mindset heading into the Garland picks up his second. Cole Anthony pulls up, jump shot. 
got it to go. Cole Anthony. And Carroll, under five to play, drives inside, left-handed, in and out. Kicks it to keep it alive, and Isaac comes up with it. Gary Harris, a clean look. That's a three. I'm not going to lie. They're playing good, Little bro. Season opening. Uh, kicks it back out. I'm telling you, bro, young teams might be on the rise, man. Hey, young teams might be on the rise, bro. Hey, them Thunder might surprise on um, Maz, bro. Oh, that ball's an aisle from Harris. Mitchell gets it back. Mitchell drives inside. Bank shot is good. Hard drive from Mitchell. Mitchell tells him to bring it up the floor. Levert goes right at Isaac. Shot is up and good. What a move from Levert with Isaac draped over him. And the Magic needs timeout. The lead's been cut to 12. And Carroll. Inside pass to Suggs. Blocked by Mobley. His third rejection. Yeah, hang a lot. whole lot of defense being played right now. Six here in the second. whole lot of defensive highlights. I like this NBA. Levert. Uh, I'm waiting with the Rondo. Ooh. Ooh. I'm waiting with the Rondo. Uh, caught him with the uh, bag. Okay, I like that. I'm going to be honest, though. Y'all might not like it. I like defensive highlight. I like. I, li I love watching defense. I like watching blocks and steals, transition bucket, transition three. I like watching shit like that, bro. I don't like when the NBA cut out defense and and make it like the high. I mean, I understand like they highly got to stay within about the 10 minute range, kind of where they stay at. But I personally like watching defense, man. Suggs drives on a curl, shot blocked. Mitchell was right there to help. Another player goes crashing to the floor. Merrill puts up a three, puts it in. Shot okay, Cleveland. They go that home crowd now. Defense, yeah, they're gonna home crowd. Man, I boy got 24 and a half. You looking like bro um Anthony Edwards last night. Wagner misses Wagner, Wagner only two points. He was in foul trouble. Mitchell gets inside, lays it up and in. I now second half. What you got for me? D Mitch. D Mitch put up like 20 points in the fourth quarter last time they played, I think. Harris had three points in the first half. Nice lob pass and Carter throws it down. And Mitchell has it. That was some great defense, but Suggs is shaken up after that defensive play on the layup. Mitchell leans in, hits another three. Man, that was a three. Mitchell, but Suggs is shaken up after that defensive play on the layup. Mitchell leans in, hits another three. Good shot. Yeah. Probably about two points of four fouls. Mitchell scoots away, gets inside. Lamp is good. Damn. Away from Donovan Mitchell. Hey, Donovan Mitchell, take it. He calling a call 45, boy. Hey. Call 40 freaking five, bro. Mm -hmm. What's up, boy? Here we go, Dan Carroll. Get right, bro. You had 24 in the first half, bro. You mentioned passing that, bit. Hey, you Mitch not passing that shit no more. He in that mode. He's in that mode. <laughs> and one, hey, D. Mitch in that mode. <laughs> hey, hey, Donovan Mitchell, boy. Ooh, that hey, Spider Boy. Ooh, you cold. Hey, Donovan Mitchell calling his. Mm, boy, hey, I'm trying my best to. I'm family friendly. We're a family friendly channel, bro. So I'm, I'm trying my best not to. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But look, hey. Busting their ass. <laughs> hey, hey, Donovan Mitchell said, look, I don't know what he went in that locker room and said. He probably was like, man, I ain't going to lie. I ain't passing the ball no more. It's time. It's go time. <laughs> it's go time for me. I'm sorry, y'all, but I'm going to take y'all home because that's what the heck he doing, bro. He look like game seven Braun right now. Game seven Kyrie. Nah, game seven Donovan Mitchell, boy. <laughs> game seven Donovan Mitchell. He calling his number right now. He calling his own number right now. Good bucket, folks. Don, look, Don Mitchell not passing. You know Jalen Brown vibe. Look, he not passing. Look, bucket. <laughs> he's not passing in that bag. He's in that mode. That boy, that look, he's not passing. <laughs> he had to right there. Give it back to Donovan Mitchell. Shout out, Struz. That's Karen. That's what Shrews do. Little, 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 little Donovan Mitchell, look, give and go. He went it back. Give it back to him. Okay, Shrews. Okay, Shrews. Help him out then. Help him out then, Shrews. 
in that third quarter. Joe Ingles back in the game. Help him out there, Struz. Fultz pulls up. Elbow jumper is good. I like seeing Fultz. I, like, I, I love seeing Hoots, man. Um, Fultz Hoot, man. Because I understand what he's been yeah, through. But Ladonna Mitchell, that's cash. Mitchell Knockdown. Not playing with these boys right now. Not playing. You might put 50 on them. Donovan Mitchell might put. Give the ball to Donovan Mitchell. Or my daughter Levert. One. Man, ain't calling no fouls, too. I like the refs this game. But hey, the ref let him move. Yeah, give it to Van Carroll, but let him go to work. Oh, Van Carroll comes down the other way and slams it, and it's 85 77. There's Van Carroll. Gets free. Seven on the shot clock. The spin move. The layup. Can't get it. Carter the rebound. Goes back up. Bats it in. And a foul. Wendell Carter. Offensive rebound. Garland looking. Pulls back. Struess back to Garland. Garland searching for an opening. Nice feet inside. The Mobley layup is good. Beautiful move from Mobley. Off the ball. Back to 10 point lead. I ain't gonna lie. They're doing anything right now. Donovan Mitchell. 37. Carl goes inside. Double team. Can't get it. Gets it back. Goes back up again. Mm -hmm. Lays it up and in. Tough shot Damn. from Van Caro. And he's hobbling right now. Man, Ben Carroll hurt a little bit. Man, Ben Carroll fight through that, man. It's game seven. It's game seven, Ben Carroll. They need you. Damn. I'm not going to lie, though, y'all. I see what the downfall of, 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 of Orlando is right now. They don't got nobody else. Like, I'm going to be honest. Hans Wagner. Well, that shit you was talking game four. I think it was game four or game five. One of them two. I didn't know because the, the home team never lost. I think. So, I think it was two Yales, two old Cleveland 2-2, two, two, um, yeah, the home team never lost. So the last game I watched, I believe, was game five. Because I think that was, you know, game five was in Cleveland. I think I watched game, you know, it wasn't game six. It was game four. I think game four was the last game I watched. And that was when fans watched, fans probably know was talking all that shit. Now, I ain't going to front. They lose this game, I'm going to be honest. It's cause, I ain't going to say it's because of him specifically. But, bro, all that, this is that time you get to talking all that. You feel me? On the road, game seven. Do or die. Yeah, this is when you talk all that shit you was talking about. Not 2-2 two -two series. You feel me? It's a seven-game series a long time to go. Donovan Mitchell, yeah, he probably going to talk his. But Donovan Mitchell stayed down, came up. And it looked like, I mean, for the most part, it looked like them boys about to secure this win right here. I'm going to be honest, friends. Right? That's, that's, this is the time that you, this the time that you turn up, bro. I'm going to be honest. This is a lesson learned. It's a lesson learned for you, bro. Hey, I'm not a, I'm not, I'm not a front running person, bro. I don't like front running, bro. I'm a, if I'm gonna talk shit, I'm gonna talk shit. When I'm down, I'm gonna talk shit. When I'm up, hey man. Dang, Cleveland ain't won a series in six years. I know he lost to the Knicks last year. But damn, this been six years. That was that was Braun, 2018. Dang. God, leave. But, but no, I'm gonna tell I'm gonna say it like this though. Shout out to the the magic though, bro. Shout out to the magic. This is this is look. At the end of the day, Ben Carroll, I wouldn't beat yourself up about it. Hey, you won, you won, went out there and who? You went out there and put your best foot forward, my brother. So first off, we got to give him a round of applause and a shout out to him. He did what he needed to do, but. A young team, bro. The, the the Magic, bro. They they one of the, they literally are one of the youngest teams in the league. Jamal Mosley, one of the younger coaches in the league, and bro to be the fifth seed in the in the in the East, one of the best defensive teams in the league. Period. Take took the Cavs to seven. That's that's an accomplishment, man. That's a hell of an accomplishment. So shouts out to them. They're gonna come back next year. They're gonna be strong. I think they probably uh sit around this four or five seed range. Though I don't think they're gonna go any higher than that. I feel like. Boston is going to be the best team. Milwaukee's going to be number two, number three, number two, number three. And the Knicks, I think, going. I feel like the Knicks going to stay kind of where they're at, too. I think the, the four through eight is kind of where it's like, okay, Atlanta, Toronto, them, Orlando, Cleveland, um, Indiana. Like, that's kind of where they're going to fight. They're going to fight for those seeds. But, I mean, I feel like the top three is pretty set. But either way it goes, shouts out to Cleveland. Um, we got Cleveland Celtics. I'm kind of mad a little bit. I really wanted to go to a playoff game, but maybe next year. <laughs> maybe next year the Heat, Orlando, or the Pelicans, or one of the teams I'm close to make it. Maybe the Mavs. I was supposed to go to the Mavs, but whatever. We'll be in a different position later on.
and really it'd be able to go to a game. But anyways, though, y'all, hope y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all did, make sure y'all leave a like. Comment down below y'all predictions for this uh, Cavs-Celtic series. I think, honestly, man, I think the Cavs got enough fight to get one game at home. Maybe game three, maybe game four. But um, I think the Celtics, gentlemen, sweep or sweep them, them boys. I'm going to be honest. Um, Yeah. Because uh, uh. the way I see it, bro, I watched a smooth, like, three out of these seven games, and Donovan Mitchell is the X factor, bro. It seems like you, you X Donovan Mitchell out the game or make it very extremely tough for Donovan Mitchell to score, bro. It's nobody that's willing to pick up the slack other than Levert. I mean, Garland, Garland didn't seem like he did too much. Um, Jared Allen's hurt. I don't know how long he's hurt for. Mobley didn't really seem like he picked up the slack. Like, Allen, the way Allen was dogging them boys games one through four, Mobley wasn't really dogging them boys these last two games. Um, And I think Jason Tatum, Jalen Brown, Derek White, Drew Holiday, Porzingis, I think they just going to be too much, man, for um, – but y'all leave down below y'all predictions, comments, all of that. I appreciate it. And I will be reacting to other things soon. I definitely want to watch Caitlin Clark's um, WNBA debut uh, preseason. I know it's, it's a little while, but yeah, we definitely going to be reacting to that. So y'all definitely stay tuned. And yeah, man, I'll holler at you on the next one.